An Arkansas judge is deciding whether Washington County violated the Freedom of Information Act. Good evening, everyone. I'm Chelsea Helms. And I'm Chad Mira. Thanks for joining us tonight at 6. KNBA's Anna Darling was in the courtroom today. She joins us now to break down what the lawsuit was about. Anna. Yeah, guys, Washington County Justice of the Peace Beth Coger is bringing this lawsuit forward. It's over a subcommittee meeting of the Criminal Justice Coordinating Committee that happened on February 7th of this year. The meetings were being held over Zoom during the pandemic, but just a few minutes before that February 7th pretrial services subcommittee meeting, the Criminal Justice Coordinator Drew Smith found out that Zoom webinars would no longer be supported. She emailed Coger and a few others from the Arkansas Justice Reform Coalition to tell them about the issue. They replied asking her to postpone the meeting, but the meeting went on without finding a solution to allow the public to attend, and the meeting wasn't recorded either. Coger claims this is a violation of Arkansas's FOIA law. The public has to be present in these meetings to, to hear what's being said, to push for reforms, to bring information forward. The county argued in court that even though it may not have been the best decision to hold the meeting without the public and may have even violated Arkansas's open meeting laws, it's not a violation of FOIA because CJCC is not made up of governing body members. I asked county attorney Brian Lester if he had a comment about today's proceedings. He said he has no comment right now as this case is still pending. And the judge did not make a ruling in this case today and it could be early August before we get a decision. Reporting in studio, Anna Darling, KWA, Northwest Arkansas News. 